<laughs> Why are you so sneaky? Because I am. How's your morning? We got sprayed by police with the pepper gas. With the pepper gas, but no. And also my throat hurts. But I'm just. That was yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday. I think it's going to be a nice trip. So we will see together. <laughs> Bonjour YouTube, today we're back in Normandy and we are in Evre. Evre. This is a small city that is a capital of the uh, department. department. Yes. And uh, so we're gonna go and check it out. Um, behind us is the Notre Dame Cathedral of Evre. We'll obviously check it out as well. And on you are? On you are. This cathedral w was initially built, they started building it in uh, 11th century. That's wonderful. They started building it uh, in the 11th century and then it got damaged, then they restored it. And then in the Second World War, it got really, really badly damaged. So they only restored it by the 1970s. And um, inside it is um, the organ that's currently there. It's very new. It features a very modern design. It only was constructed in 2006. Also, this cathedral features stained glass windows from the 14th and 13th century that are considered to be a shadow work of art. And um, yeah, it's just a fantastic place to see. Actually, this city reminds me of Chart. I don't know, it's so similar, like so much greenery. And the unique thing about the cathedral in Normandy region is that the flash in the center is extend to the ceiling. So it looks like you are looking up to the tower. And it's, it's a unique feeling that you have when you visit Normandy region. We have this type of cathedral in Rouen. This is the second time I'm seeing this and I just fell in love with this. So the people in this museum are so nice, they're so 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 nice. Um, they saw us coming in with a camera and they were like, oh, uh, we are not sure if it's allowed or if it's not allowed, blah, blah, blah. And then they called their, uh, I think the, she was the directress of the museum mm -hmm. and um, they were basically like, oh, who are you, blah, blah, blah. So we told them we have a channel, blah, blah. <laughs> the lady at the reception, she subscribed. and. Um, I think it's so nice when people are nice. They're giving us some information about the, you know, extra information about the museum. Um, so basically, follow me. The museum is located in 
um, building where the Archivec used to live. And um, this building is one of the last, actually is I think one of the, or probably the only building of this size uh, that is uh, purely uh, Renaissance style from medieval times. It is absolutely stunning outside and inside. And uh, yeah, you should definitely pass by. It's free entry. The people inside are really nice. <laughs> They're really nice. Hi, new subscriber. Thank you. <laughs> but yeah, it was, it was, it's really cool. You should definitely check it out. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. Look at it. So Oeuvre, the city that was bombarded like crazy during the Second World War, uh, the buildings behind me, are, they used to be completely like, this was all rebuilt because everything was bombarded and um, this, this city actually suffered a lot during the Second World War. Now you wouldn't even notice it, you wouldn't recognize it, you wouldn't think that it happened. This is what I like, how they redo things in France. You know, if something has been bombarded, they don't build something that's totally new. They build something that respects the, uh, you know, the past and respects the architecture of the past most of the time, not all the time. The best example of that is Saint Malo. It's a city that's in Bretagne or Brittany. Um, but yeah, Evreux is the same. It's, um, it's a city that was rebuilt. The whole city is amazing, but my favorite part is Cathedral and the museum right next to it. I love the building. It feels like you're in a small chateau and there is a person upstairs waiting for you. <laughs> it's a bright new day and it's your time to shine. <laughs> Apparently it's a bright new day and it's his time to shine. Of course, it's a bright new day for everybody. <laughs> Um, sure. Okay. Uh, so what's your favorite part about this city? <laughs> the city? Yeah. I love the fact that there, there are rivers like going around it, the central city. I love it. You go and there's a canal here, there's a canal there. Uh, the cathedral is amazing. Um, it's very green. They have so much greenery, but they don't have so many options for vegetarians. For, for eating, <laughs> yeah. <they don't> <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they don't have many options to eat when it comes to vegetarian. Apparently, we couldn't find it at least, you know, so I don't know. But um, one thing I love about Normandy, every time I come here, I feel, I feel very comfortable here. I feel comfortable here. I feel positive here. I feel like um, it's a nice place to be in. doesn't matter which city. So far, we've been to several and all of them turned out to be amazing. All of them turned out to be um, Welcoming. Unique. No, but they were welcoming. Yeah. They're welcoming and you don't feel like you don't feel like there is a rush or something crazy. You don't feel it. It's nice. It's nice. Sinan is making faces while he's holding the camera, so yeah. Come to Normandy. 